Well, good afternoon from Two Happy Children Farm. We're doing something new this year for us. Um, last year we did a grid sampling of our cornfield, and with high fertilizer prices, we decided to um, not do much on fertilizer, but instead we applied lime. And this year we saw a huge improvement with our pH going from low fives to mid sixes and it showed up in the yield as well. Um, this is the same outfit doing the work he did the lime last year and right now he's working on an area of the field that was like a donut hole for our yields and uh, it correlated to um, really low phosphorus and uh, potassium in that field. It was the part of the field that had a nice ideal pH so I think over the years we'd be able to mine out the potassium and phosphorus a little bit faster. So he's doing a variable rate application. You can see that right there he's really put it on heavy. Uh, this is a 50-50 blend of uh, potash and dap at some points he's putting 800 to 1,000 pounds an acre there. So the nice part about the prescription is I uh, asked the guys who did the soil testing uh, to calculate how much DAP we would need to get up to a certain parts per million and uh, they did that so that's how much DAP he's applying and it just corresponded as well to being short on potassium. So doing a 50-50 blend and it's all going out at the same time. Um, last year we were looking at over $1,000 a ton on most of the products and this year we've had a nice back off on that so we figured it would be a good year to invest and get the field over the hole. year to see the, the pH issues um, after doing a good grid sample. So I think once you get the data you can see what's going on and why. And take care of it when you can. So he's going nice and easy. That's putting on a really heavy rate. This buggy can probably hold seven and a half tons at a time. and uh, this is all correlating to a grid sample soil test. We're not, we're not just spreading it where, wherever. We're putting it exactly where the need was. And if I had to do this, the equivalent with uh, just you know full broadcast, full acres, uh, it'd be a triple the price. So this is really saving and just putting it out where it needs it, not over applying it as well. spreading pattern. You can see as it goes through the boundary where there's very little coming out. Now a little bit more. Now the amount's coming out. So a variable opens up the gate to let her out the right amount out. Thanks for watching.